Life of the Farm. This is Grandma's Kitchen. Today we will be making zucchini rocks. Hi, I'm Grandma, and this is my kitchen. First, you need a little helper who will help you make the zucchini brownie. First, you need to butter your pan. Make sure you have an adult to help you with your cooking. Make sure to preheat the oven to 350 Fahrenheit. The first ingredient you're going to need is a zucchini. You gotta cut the zucchini. Next, you have to take the seeds out. Then you have to shell the zucchini. Make it into little tiny bits so it's all small for the brownie. You don't want to eat chunks. You only need two cups of zucchini, so make sure you don't shred any more than you need. This is what two cups of shredded zucchini looks like. Next, you will need one cup, only one cup, of potato flour. Next, you need one and a half cups white sugar. Make sure to use a separate cup for dry ingredients and wet ingredients. Next, you need a half a cup of unsweetened cocoa. One and a half teaspoons of baking soda. Next, you need one teaspoon of salt. Next, you need a half cup of vegetable oil. Next, you need two teaspoons of vanilla extract. the extract over a different bowl so it doesn't splatter in your mixture and you add too much by accident. You might want to mix the ingredients before adding the zucchini. You need two cups of zucchini to add. Next you mix the zucchini. Next you dump the zucchini batter into the pan. so awesome that I wear them every day now. Nike, get them. They're cool. I work out. <laughs> Looks like the brownies are done. They have a different texture than the normal brownies. We'll see how they taste. Sort of like gooey and doughy. Moist. Mm mm. Chocolate. <laughs> kind of like gum. <laughs> 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 